Hello dear students, welcome to Devika's Commerce and Management Academy. Business Statistics 2, important questions I brought for you all. Uh, by the way, in this Business Statistics 2, three chapters already I have covered. It was in the old playlist when I started this channel. The video quality was not so good, audio and everything was poor. So once again, I started new, I started preparing new videos. Anyway, old list also you can follow first three units. That link is there in the old list. That playlist I'm going to share with you in the description box and also in the comment box. You can check it out. Anyway, new list, I have covered this first unit. Second unit is in the process. Important questions. Don't leave even a single question also. Because whatever I'm giving you, everything is important. At least some knowledge you need to have. So without wasting much time, let's discuss about each and every unit point of view. Important questions. First unit is, you know, regression analysis regression analysis we have only regression equations only based on regression equations we have one more problem also total three uh, three videos only i have uploaded that three videos link you can find it in the new playlist of uh, business statistics 2 so in regression analysis what you can expect is one question what is regression analysis explain its importance types and limitations one important question okay and another one correlation versus regression very important 90 to 95 percent you can expect this one don't leave it okay anyway practicals are quite easy regression analysis practicals i already taught in old list and also in new list so don't leave regression equation so if it is 100 marks entire syllabus this is 20 marks you should not miss it okay second one is in the second unit you can talk about index numbers first question is define index numbers its characteristics uses and types of index numbers in types of index numbers you will have weighted unweighted and under unweighted different types weighted and once again classified i think you have idea I already covered in our channel okay so first theory question you can expect what is index numbers explain its characteristics uses and types of index numbers and second one what is last years pastures fishers and marshall marshall and cost of living uh, index numbers these things you can expect in the theory what is this what is last years index number what is fishers index numbers like this you can expect any one and coming to the practicals Index numbers, you know that uh, weighted and unweighted index numbers are there. Any index number you can expect, especially uh, as I explained, last years, past years, fishers. Apart from that, first one is time reverse index number and factor reverse index number. These two are very much important. Some data will be given to you. Explain that whether it is satisfying the time reversal test or factor reversal test. So this is very important and also cost of living index numbers. So this is about index numbers second unit. Now coming to the third unit. In third unit we will be discussing about uh, time series and moving averages. So important theory questions are only three I have given you. Define time series characteristics components advantages and methods. And second one discuss the methods of moving averages its merits and limitations. Third one, define least square methods, advantages and limitations. These three, we have some idea about practicals. When we have an idea about practical, theory is also very easy. Once you just read it like a novel, you can understand because practical knowledge we have. Right? Three, only three questions I have given you. And practicals, what you can expect is here, moving averages, one problem you can expect. In moving averages, uh, you will find odd number and even number. Whether odd or even, both the sides you must be thorough, be prepared. And another uh, practical question you can expect is least square method. You can uh, calculate trend value and also trend line also you can construct it. This is also only two practical problems. Moving averages and least square method. Okay. So these three units are business statistics. And next to fourth and fifth units, these two are mathematics point of view. Uh, in fact, to be frank, I am not much perfect in mathematics. That is the reason I did not cover. But anyway, I am sure in future, I am going to learn these two units. I will upload it in our channel. Right now, I can give you important questions of the first one. 
एक्सप्लेन द वेरियस टर्म्स यूज इन प्रॉबिलिटी थियरी की कॉन्सेप्ट परमिटेशंस एंड कॉम्बिनेशन वन क्वेश्चन वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट दिस वन थी पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू सेकेंड वन एक्सोमेटिक अप्रोच एप्लीकेशन ऑफ बेस थियरम ओके एंड थर्ड वन एक्सप्लेन टू थिंग्स वन इज म्यूचुअली एक्सक्लूसिव इवेंट्स एंड नॉन म्यूचुअली एक्सक्लूसिव इवेंट्स only three questions important for the examination point of view probability okay and also also practicals are there so whatever is possible easy you can just learn now coming to the last unit so this is only i have prepared only four questions first one is what is binomial distribution and important and second one what are the features and assumptions of poisson distribution and what are the properties of normal distribution and explain in detail about the central limit theorem only four question 3 plus 4 7 7 is mathematics and statistics point of view 1 2 4 4 5 6 7 7 7 statistics and here this is also 7 i think 5 6 7 yes 7 plus 7 only 14 questions are given to you but don't worry about the examinations these three are quite damn easy mathematics uh, let us see i don't have much idea anyway if you have some idea you can just prepare this one also or uh, if you read the test book someone is going to help you definitely prepare this one now if you have these three units idea at least you can score 60% easily 50 to 60% easily and theory if you prepare also 80% to 90% you can if you are missing practicals theory you can prepare it right so in examination when you go to the examination don't worry you know everything practicals you have to be thorough the more you practice it you will become more perfect what do you say so business statistics don't worry important questions list is given to you prepare only this one and practicals you have to be thorough that's it in the next uh, series i'll prepare some other important questions let me know what subjects you are expecting prepare well uh, check out our playlist there are many subjects which already prepared by me and whatever is useful you can use the entire playlist and do forward it to someone who is struggling to study get a good marks do share your marks do share your exam paper also how you have written did you get the same questions or not i wanted to hear so take care practice well good luck